What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Aiden here. I was just over here editing um, the Glued Together podcast. I've been waking up, it's like 50% of the time I wake up at 6 and 50% of the time I wake up at 5. It just depends on like what I got going on. Um, but I set up this little like, I'm using antlers chair, set up this little spot to record videos but my computer is so slow, it's just taking forever. Um, so I have to stop, I didn't get to finish, um, but I have to get ready and hit the gym. So that's where we're going next. Um, yeah, and hi, it's good to see y'all again. Oh my goodness, so I don't think I made a video like this since, I don't know, Oregon, but I've lived in Texas for two years, in Florida for a year, and it's starting to get, now I'm in New York, and it's starting to get dark and cold, and uh, I'm not used to it, really not used to it. All right, so just leaving the gym. Yes, I'm still working out. Uh, that has not changed. I will say, however, the amount I'm able to work out and the consistency has definitely changed since having a kiddo. Um, that's for sure. Uh, but, let me put you right here. Uh, oh, I get to stand. Maybe not, maybe. Um, I gotta get used to using a phone. Usually I have my just my actual I'll just hold I'll just hold it I'll just hold it um so yeah so still training I just did a back and uh back and what did I do back and triceps um I hurt my I, I've been I was doing abs at the end of my training every day but I hurt, like I don't know I pulled something um on my right lower ab so I haven't been doing that at all. But uh, yeah, other, I really wanna put you here. I really just feel like this would be the spot to go. Except for the light, I guess, maybe not. Um, so, damn. Um, so yeah, so just getting used to, again, like I feel like I used to be so comfortable just filming out in the wild um, and I'm not as comfortable as I once was. So getting a little more used to that, so sorry for some terrible angles. I also don't have any stand or anything, um, but I honestly, I'm using my phone because I was comparing my computer, my, uh, I was comparing my camera that I have at home, my power shot, which I guess is super old now, um, to my phone and my phone is way better. So doing this, uh, I'm gonna go home, see Antler before he heads off to school and uh, start work. So here we go. Can you show me your Spongebob? Spongebob what? Shirt. You going to school? I was telling my Spongebob, you want to see my Spongebob underwear? No, they don't need to see your Spongebob underwear. We believe you. <laughs> All right, so uh, this is like my little office cubby that I got going on here. Um, it's in the same room that the computer I work on for the podcast is over there, or the vodcast as I like to call it. Um, but, so you might be wondering like, Aiden, what, <laughs> what the hell do you even do these days? Well, let me tell you what I do. Um, so let me, there we go, got a sand for this. So uh, what I do is I work for Out in Tech as an engagement manager. And Out in Tech is a nonprofit that helps LGBTQ plus people get jobs um, and also educates different companies on how to hire like DEIB efforts. Um, so that's fun. Um, then I still am with Point of Pride. So doing that work there, um, that nonprofit is growing. I'm so excited. Um, we just hired our um, co the other co-founder, Jeff, um, 
for the executive director job. So that's really exciting. So we've got like two full-time positions now um, and that's continuing to grow. So really cool to see that happen. Um, for you, those who may not know, uh, we worked with Mercury Stardust and we raised $2.3 million this last Transgender Day of Visibility. So really excited about that, able to help thousands of more people. Um, we've given, we've, we've almost reached our $1 million given away mark, um, like given to trans folks. Um, and we are, I think we've all, we've reached over 19,000 people and I think we're about to hit our 10,000th garment. Um, so that's really exciting. Um, I'll put more info, like you can check it out in the link below. Um, and then I have Trace. So Trace is an app for trans and non-binary folks to both document their transition and build community. I'll make specific videos on like both where I've been at with Point of Pride, where I've been at with Trace. Um, so it's kind of like Out in Tech is my full-time day job. Um, Point of Pride and Trace are my uh, like side hustles. Um, I, I wouldn't even call them side hustles. I'd call them uh, I was working full time with Trace, but I had to step back um, to like make money. Um, so now Taylor is really holding all of Trace and I'm just kind of helping out with visibility and stuff. Um, but I, I mean, I'll, I'll get more into that uh, in other videos. But yeah, so this is what I do. Um, I've got a couple of meetings today. Um, and that's like what my job is now, is like I, I work with different corporations um, and companies to help them in their DEI and B efforts in hiring and education. And I meet, pretty much like meet with them all week, I have like multiple, multiples of multiples of meetings a week, um, which is fine, because that's what I like to do. Like, I like to talk, I like to meet with people. Um, so yeah, so that's what I'll be doing. And again, like, I'm trying to look at you at the camera, but I keep wanting to look over here so I can see myself. Um, but yeah, hopefully these, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to get back into videos. Um, you know what, I'm gonna have this meeting, have my lunch, and then I'll let you know why I'm excited to get back into videos. But uh, just finished my protein shake um, and definitely making a cup of coffee. This is my cup from yesterday. The coolest dad. Oh yeah, that's me. Okay, so hover over the little blue. Okay now? Yeah, hit the button. Great job. Thank you. Please like, like that. This is a video. You wanna say hi? Oh yeah. Do you wanna be on video? Yeah. Okay. Hi Mima. Do you want to see a picture of yourself from last year, Halloween? Yeah, we have a picture of you from Halloween last year. I didn't want it. You don't want to see it? I want to see it. Okay, go look. Go ahead. Dad, don't even touch it. Okay, I won't touch it. I don't think you can hear, but but Antler's at basketball practice, and I'm just walking this track. Cause all I do is sit down now. So there he goes. All right, back from uh, basketball, and now we've made a fort. All right, dude. What do we put in the fort? Cars. Cars. Can I go in yet? We have to show. I want to go in though. I haven't gone in. Mom. Show me. Come. Mima. Come on. Can you show me, Bub? Come on. Oh, you done? Yeah. I'm going in. I'm going in. Come on. Let's get in so they can see. Oh no! What? It collapsed. I gotta fix the fort. Right. Issue resolved. You get in. I'm gonna go in. Okay. Can I squeeze in this thing? Excellent. Hold on. Let me get in. First, this is pretty cool in here. I don't want to knock it over. Okay. What do we got in here? We got our cars mm -hmm. and a window. 
Okay, go ahead. You can come in. Yeah. Come in. Come in. Are you coming? Me? Yeah. Mama and me, Ma. Oh. You didn't know you were ready. Last, last word we heard was, wow, look at that fort. It's a castle. We're inside it. You don't have to yell at you. <laughs> and we have Oh, no, it's falling. Wait, you I'm can the best come fort in. maker. You can come in. Thank you. I'm going to finish making dinner and I'll be back. <laughs> Nobody can come in with us. What do you mean I'm in here? I know. I want other people. I don't count. There's just only so much room in here, dude. One more person. One more person, maybe, if they were your size. I know. I'm saying, like, they can sit on the ground. Oh, on the ground right there. Okay. On the ground. Okay. All yeah. right. Good morning. It is a few days later. Um, 5.32, something like that, in the morning. Gotta be quiet because everyone's sleeping. Um, but, so, the reason I'm excited to make videos... Hold on, let me get a stand. That's one thing that I'm not used to when using the phone. I have to always use my little stand I have. All right. Okay. So I'm excited to make videos again because I have like consistently wanted to make videos and just never did. <laughs> um, it's not like I stopped on purpose. I stopped making videos because life just got really wild. Um, and, and Wild as in having a kid is a lot. And I didn't necessarily want to share every single intimate moment I had with my child online. So I feel like we're at a place now where two things have happened. One thing is Antler's a little bit older. Um, and so uh, he's more busy. So I have, I have time to make videos while, you know, in between times at work, in between times when he's playing and doing basketball and stuff like that. Um, so that's one thing is that I feel like I just have more, slightly, slightly more availability. Um, hence why it's 5.30 in the morning, um, 5.33 to be exact. Um, this is where I make the time. Um, I don't necessarily have the time, but I just make the time. And then, so that's one reason. But then number two is I feel like I've learned boundaries better. I feel like I used to just share every single moment of my life with y'all. And it was a beautiful thing at that time. And now that I have this other being, this child, um, it didn't feel it didn't feel beautiful to share every intimate moment. It actually felt more like invasive to my journey, Jane Lee's journey, Antler's journey of being a father, mother, child, infant, baby. Um, and yeah, there's like, we love to share. We're, you know, we love to share him. Um, we love to share our lives. We have our podcast glued together, which is really exciting. Um, but overall, I think we just, I've learned when is appropriate to share. Like, when does this feel like a moment that I want to share versus when does this feel like a moment that in the past I think I thought I had to share. So, um, so yeah, so I feel like I've gotten better boundaries. I hope my plan is to make a video a week and it's fun like I feel a sense of like I'm editing the video right now and this is the last clip for the video and I feel just a sense of like joy and creativity um, and excitement when I think about making videos so that's the plan the plan is we'll I'll be making our one episode of glue together a week and then my one episode of like a vlog style. So hopefully 
y'all enjoy it. Um, if you're an OG watcher, make sure you leave a comment below. Let me know you're still here. Um, otherwise, you can like the video. If you're new and you're like, I don't even know what this guy's talking about, um, you can subscribe. Um, my 14th year on testosterone is October 30th, which um, is very soon. I think it's in 34 days, if, according to my Trace app. So, all right. Well, I'll talk to y'all soon. Peace.